Bamon Lang Nombri, State Program Manager of National Health Mission. I'm very privileged uh, to be here today to attend this health summit, which is organized by Selco Foundation. Uh, we in uh, Meghalaya, we have partnered with Selco Foundation for the last uh, four years uh, in terms of uh, installation of the solarization of health facilities and also uh, uh, having uh, installed all these energy efficient equipments at the uh, sub-centers and paid seats. We have uh, about uh, 360 sub-centers solarized and about 50 paid seats uh, at present in our state and we look forward to completion of the solarization by the year by December 2024. Uh, it has been a great uh, learning experience and partnership with Selco Foundation in terms of solarization because we are able to you know to uh, make all our subcenters and PHCs or uh, you know, delivery points especially at a subcenter level and to be able to provide that kind of essential maternal and child health services in these uh, facilities. That being the first phase, we are looking at the second phase now on how to adopt and to institutionalize all these, uh, you know, uh, our health facilities which we have already been solarized. Uh, we are not looking only at uh, solarization aspect, we are also looking at long term and how to adopt methods and strategies uh, in uh, having a climate uh, resilient health facilities and also uh, a clean and green energy. Uh, we at the state of Meghalaya, we are looking at ways and means how can this be done with the help of our partners and also uh, with the, uh, all the key stakeholders who are involved in this. Uh, coming from a government entity, uh, we do have a lot of challenges and we are trying to find out the best uh, solution and mechanisms. And how should we go about this uh, in making it an automated system in our facilities so that people take ownership and accountability of the uh, of our health facilities which is running now. So uh, we from the state, we are doing a lot of, uh, taking a lot of initiative and we also try to motivate all our field staff in terms of to bring in the best of leadership, you know, to take it forward and how can we build in this uh, in, the, in, uh, in the process in whichever they are, uh, you know, uh, uh, implementing the uh, different kinds of services in the health facilities. Uh, there are two learnings which I have learned today uh, from this uh, attending this workshop. Uh, number one is we still have to do a lot of work when it comes to operations and management in which we have to identify the escalation mechanisms for operational work and also for maintenance of all the equipments and also to standardize all the uh, different levels of what are the different kinds of protocols that we have to develop for any kind of breakdown or any kind of, uh, you know, short circuits, any kinds of issues that we face at the health facilities. Thank you.